lady, 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 gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, ladies and gents, we, we, we got something that we want to talk to y'all about. I had somebody call me and they asked me, they said, you did the Chris video. And they said to me, I know you're tired. I said, I'm tired. They said, I know you're real tired. I said, I'm real tired. They said, but I just need to know if you can tell me how to find the Chris system for my court. And I said, what's the court? He told me, Michigan. And I said, well, first they invest in mutual funds and municipal funds. So basically you type in court investment municipal funds. They didn't find it. So then I found it, y'all. I found it for his state. And I'm gonna tell you how to find it for your state to prove that they invest. Now, what they're gonna claim is that Congress made it legal for them to do it. Sorry, Congress didn't. <laughs> Congress had no authority to make it legal for you to make a profit off the people. Pay attention. Congress had no authority to make it legal for the court to make a profit off the people. See, what they routinely do is the court routinely orders funds to be deposited into the registry of the court. So all you gotta do is type in the Superior Court of Los Angeles County Registry of the Court, and you'll find this information. Registry of the Court, okay? We're gonna take this, this is gonna be the type, the title right here, why, why here? See, why there? Oh, and an interest-bearing account. We are gonna stop at account, because somebody's gotta do an account. Somebody's gotta keep an accounting. Now, highest, highest interest-bearing account, so they can earn the most. This is a profit. They are not a nonprofit organization. The following orders are currently placed in an interest-bearing account unless otherwise directed by court order. Accounts of minors, they make money off minors. Interpleader funds, funds paid in satisfaction of a judgment. Funds paid in satisfaction of the judgment shouldn't be going to the court. Should be going to the opposing party. Interpleaders. Interpleader fund. Interpleaders. Interpleader fund. Interpleader. So that's two things, and they're separate. They're not the same. Funds in an eminent domain proceeding. Eminent domain. You're taking somebody's property. They are required to receive just compensation. How are you going to be putting funds in an interest-bearing account to where you collect the interest? Pay attention. Any other fund ordered by ordered into the court registry. Depositing the funds, we request court orders state specifically which account funds are to be deposited. Funds can be deposited in the following. The registry of the court, county depository. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, they're a clearinghouse corporation. An interest-bearing account, court depository, earning interest, or the highest interest-bearing account, registry clerk, will solicit highest interest rates from various financial institutions. Soliciting the highest interest rate is only done when it is written in a court order. Court order. Then who keeps the interest? Amount of interest to withdraw. Amount of withdrawal. Amount of interest to withdraw. Name a person who will receive the funds. If applicable, how funds shall be received. Photo identification, birth certificate, social security card. Aw, and then they charge an administrative expense. Aw, and they deduct the 5% for the total amount that shall not exceed $50 on a non-interest bearing account. What is it if it's on an interest bearing account? Aw. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is what goes on every single day. The courts are not supposed to be making a profit off of any case. The courts are supposed to be impartial. The justice is supposed to be fair, equal. We are not finding that. Hell doggo, like the Hell doggo Treaty, ladies and gentlemen. This is Hell doggo County, Texas. Now, let's see. We did Hell doggo County, Texas, registry of the court. Uh, watch this. L O S A N G E L E S. C O U N T Y S U P E R I O R C O U R T. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, and ladies, I'm gonna hit enter right now. There's a 
a fly. Him, his buddies are already dead, but he just decided that that's why I was quiet, because he came to sit beside me. I guess he wanted to see what I was talking about, so I'm about to introduce him to what I'm talking about. I got my little, uh, it, it, it's, a, it's called a fly spreader. Yeah, I just swat them one time, and they just spread like, uh, you know, mayonnaise. Okay. Where is my registry of the court? I don't see registry of the court. I don't see registry of the court. I see all kind of Los Angeles County Superior Court, but I don't see registry. Hold on. I don't see registry of the court. And y'all know I got to see registry of the court or I ain't going to get what I'm looking for. And I always get what I was looking for. Aww. See, receive the registry of the court. Raphael Mihaya. Ladies and gentlemen, registry of the court. Every court has a registry of the court. That's where they take the money and they put it in an interest-bearing account. Well, can we go and check to see if that's what Raphael Mahaya, if that's what he does? Do you guys mind? Hold on. Tick. Talk. Tick. Talk. Uh-oh. It didn't do nothing. There we go. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Okay, Superior Court for the County of Los Angeles. Aw, uh, Early needs to go home. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, docket report, docket report, docket report. I'm looking for registry. Well, it's going to talk about the registry of the court, so it's not going to actually talk about the registry of the court. Dag nabbit. Uh, no. I needed to actually specifically talk about the registry of the court. Oh well, gotta call and ask. No, <laughs> there's a there there's a location. It's just uh, let's do registry of the court here. No, cause it's uh, we got the name of the video. Yeah, we got the name of the video. Uh, interest bearing account. Yep, it's got registry. Hold on. To be deposited into the registry of the court interest bearing account. There we go. That's what I need. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Uh oh. It wants me to search for cases. It don't want me to search for words. Look at this. It only wants me to search for cases. I can't search the website. So guess what we do? We go back. We go back, we go back, we go back, go back, go back. Hold on, be right back. Okay, this does a whole lot better. We have reports on decisions, circuit courts of Florida. Okay, registry of the court. Monty, Miami-Dade County, the 11th Judicial Circuit. Okay, the 11th Judicial Circuit. So... This is Florida Weekly, and see, that could be talking about the uh, Circuit Court of Appeals, but I think it's in Atlanta, so it's the Judicial Circuit is the county. Then you have Indianapolis Registry of the Court. Then you have Report of the State of Maryland Registry of the Court. Every court has a registry, ladies and gentlemen. That's how they do the investment. Administrative Subpoena Authority, Registry of the Court. Okay. Child Support Enforcement Agency and Canada, Los Angeles Public Works and Los Angeles Superior Court of the County, Registry of the Court, having $147,677.77 or 50 cents or whatever the cents is, he ain't got no cents, uh, held in the Registry of the Court, Superior Court of the County of Los Angeles. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, every court has a registry. Okay? All right. Now, I'm going to let y'all go. Just wanted to bring this information to y'all attention. If you want to prove that they are uh, trading, just go ahead and type it in, and you'll see exactly what a registry of the court does.
okay? You'll see that they trading these cases, trading these inmates like chattel, okay? Gotta go, ladies and gentlemen. I hope y'all have a good day. We will talk later. Adios. Arrivederci. Sorry.